Hello and welcome to the little guest house, the German sausage maker. Uh, today we changed the order of the videos. Uh, I got a request from some friends who want to have some uh, Lachschinken uh, smoked. Uh, I actually did that video before, so uh, I want to do this more. Explain the whole process and uh, well keep watching this is all we need that's uh, 70 pounds of lime pork that's black pepper that's uniberries that's uh, ginger, that is uh, ascorbine acid, vitamin C, coriander, uh, glucose, brown sugar, bay leaves, and the curing salt. Actually, German curing salt. You, you can see there's a special curing salt for ham. It's more coarse than regular uh, salt. Let's mix it together and uh, I'm going to put it in a bigger bowl. Brown sugar. Coriander, ginger, ascorbic acid, only berry. Well, I grinded them up, usually they are berries, but so it can spread better than having the berries itself. The black pepper, I grind it fresh. The bay leaves and the salt. Like I said, German curry salt. So one tip for my friends from Germany. If you need brown sugar, you can make that yourself. The only problem is you need the American molasses made from uh, mice. <laughs> the Americans might be laughing when I say that. Well, it's uh, it's corn. Uh, you mix 200 gram of sugar with 13 gram of molasses. You can do that by hand. Better do it in a kitchen mixer. You get more like, like this. That's what you want. Very easy to make because a lot of the special barbecue recipes you need that kind of sugar because American recipes, of course. So I'm gonna remove. Some of the things I don't want on there. Actually, I like a little bit fat on there. So always watch out if there are any cuts in the meat. To make sure that salt is going everywhere. Otherwise, if you you want to hang it for a while, it will uh, stop molding on that different spot. 
So keep that in mind. See, I got little bones left in this one. I don't want those. Make sure you got a sharp knife. You don't want to cut more or waste more. necessary or necessary okay that's the last piece I'm cutting so I would guess we have about 10% yeah, waste by cleaning the meat here we got the spices and I would say yes. First pieces are important, especially on the sides. Right on the bottom. always difficult to spread it evenly on the meat. After five days we're gonna turn the top part to the bottom part. There is uh, brain going down the water or the moist from the meat goes into the uh, sinks to the bottom and if we turn it frequently a couple times it will get the salt all over so we don't have any spots what's not been cured okay guys that's uh, what it looks like sorrow of being out of focus for the time I put everything in there so I uh, see you in uh, at least two weeks probably 15 days just for for safety the meat takes about two and a half day per centimeter 
and I don't even know how thick that is. Well, this is five, and I guess the bigger ones a little bit more. Five times two and a half, it's twelve and a half day. So I think we're doing pretty good with the 15. So this will go in the fridge and after three days I turn it over, turn the top part to the bottom and after another three days I will turn it back and so on. So 15 days, give me three days for making the video and I uh, will see you back then. This was part one of uh, how to make prosciutto, uh, the curry part and uh, probably will take 18 days before I come back with the second part of this video. So thanks for watching, I hope you liked it, if you do give me a thumb up, subscribe if you haven't done that so far, uh, I appreciate it, see you back over 18 days for the second part of this.